What's going on guys? I'm Tony back doing yet another die couch review and this one got pushed off for a while. Um, I'm finally getting it up now. I apologize for those of you who uh, wanted to see this one and uh, just didn't get reviewed for a long while. It is the uh, 2016 Kenny Hubble Sun Energy Xfinity 124. <clears throat> so we'll go over the box. You got uh, Junior Motorsports 588. Got a picture of the car there. There you go. Side, back, on this side you got the uh, production number, you get a good view at it. There you go, Kenny Havol 88, Sun Energy 1, one of uh, 500 made. So, I, man, I really, really wanted to pick up the Sun Energy car on one of the paint schemes. Of course, Chase Elliott ran it. I was going to get that one, and then they made the uh, Kenny Havol and Josh Berry Xfinity cars. Uh, I ended up going with the, the Kenny Havol car for one of two things. Uh, one, it was cheaper than the Chase LA car. Two, uh, I think it would look, I thought it was going to look cooler on the Camaro car, which I think it does, the Camaro body. Uh, and three, I don't have any Kenny Habool cars, so I thought it was a great opportunity to pick one up. So, on to the car. This is definitely one of my favorite paint schemes of 2016. It's, uh, it's definitely a pretty neat one. So, we'll start from the front. Of course, the, uh, the Chevy Camaro nose. You got, uh, SE1 Sun Energy 1, I guess, yeah, liters in uh, commercial, what does it say, solar? So we'll go ahead and uh, lift up the hood. I think got the engine in there. Underneath, Chevrolet Sun Energy 1 Wix. Go down the left side. I believe this is uh, Kenny Habul's uh, company, is it not? I could be wrong about that, but I feel like it is. So down the side you get a good look at the paint scheme. Of course the, the orange rims looks pretty cool in this car. Man, look at that paint scheme. That's something else. I haven't really seen anything quite like this. I don't know, I think it looks pretty darn cool. It's definitely uh, definitely pretty unique. Uh, it's just I, I think it's got a great look to it. One main uh, center G1. Very bright colors going everywhere. The nose looks pretty cool too. Look at that. So go ahead and go to the top. You got uh, Kenny Bull there. 88 Sun Energy 1 on the roof. On the back, you got Sun Energy 1, 88. And then you got Fire Alarm Services on the back. DIN number is 353. Deck lid does not open, just the uh, Gold Series die cast. So the roof flaps don't open. The deck lid doesn't open, just the roof does. Or not the roof, the hood. I don't know what I'm talking about. So down the right side, uh, no window in it, uh, I believe, I don't exactly remember each race he ran in 2016. I know he ran the road courses, he was there for, uh, for what, Watkins Glen and uh, Mid-Ohio. I believe that's it, he could have, he might have run more, I'm not really sure. Of course, Josh Berry was in this car as well, so go ahead and focus that in. Look at that, that's a pretty good looking car, I don't know, let me know what you guys think, I think it looks pretty cool. I don't know what it is. I definitely, uh, I'm definitely gonna have to get Chase Elliott's Cup car though as well. See what it looks like on there. But what I mean, it's basically the same paint scheme. I don't know. I think it looks pretty darn cool. Nonetheless, it's it's unique. I don't really have any cars quite, quite like this in my collection. So I don't know. Cody Habul diecast. I like it. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. Uh, you can check out the description. Um, Got my Twitter, Instagram, uh, Facebook page, all that stuff down below if you guys want to check that out. I always post uh, all my new die casts on there before I get them, uh, get to review them on here. So, uh, so there's that. And uh, like I said, appreciate you guys as always. And I'll catch y'all in the next video.